Rosie was born at 24 weeks and she was doing really well. Me and Leanne was happy, but thought everything was going to be fine. And then she was about two months old when she got really ill. It just happened really quickly. They just said they were going to clean the bowel. We just thought there's no way she's going to make it through operations. She's too small. She weren't even 900 grams. That's when roller coaster wires started to begin. She made it through the operation. She recovered really quickly. And then she just got really ill. Rosie was in hospital for 14 months since the day she was born. She was throwing up constantly, her bowels weren't working properly. It took a long time for her to tolerate anything. I first heard of short bowel syndrome intestinal failure when Rosie was diagnosed with it. It's not a life for anyone, basically. Our life has changed completely since Rosie's come home. This has turned everything upside down. It's a ripple, it don't affect just Rosie, it affects the whole family. The less people who access her line, there's less risk of infection. She's had the wire around her neck before. The alarms go off constantly because she's laying <laughs> on the wires. We get up every hour. I get a break, I go to work. Where Leanne doesn't get a break and she's here constantly, regardless if she ain't doing nothing when I'm looking after it. She's always on my mind. You can't ignore her temperature, you can't ignore her pulling at her line. Anything could be a sudden change. Our life before, it was good. We did stuff as family. Now, we've lost so many friends, we don't go out. The girls, sadly, are always pushed to the side because we have to put Rosie's safety and her health needs first. Nothing is like how it used to be before. So she's progressing. I didn't think we would be where we are now. She's smiling, she's happy, so that compensates for it. She plays with you and she gives you cuddles. It's really nice. She starts nursery. It's a special needs nursery. My aim is for her to go there for about a year and then hopefully to go to a mainstream nursery after. It doesn't matter what illnesses she's got. I just want her to be happy. That's the main thing.